Oh yeah, this is definitely different from the uh, the alpha. And oh, this game is gorgeous. I forgot how pretty this was. And oh boy, look at this. Oh, we're going over. We're going down. No. 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 Time to hit the loop and time to get that bolt. Oh. Oh, we got it. We got it. We made it. Oh, we. Got Hello YouTube, Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys my first impressions of Trailmakers, and yes folks, Trailmakers is finally here. We can finally play it. Well, I can play it today. You guys can play this tomorrow. I do want to go ahead and thank the developer for giving me early access to the early access. So, we're going to be jumping into this here today. We're going to start off with Expedition Mode, which is our kind of story mode, and just learn, I don't want to say learn the basics because I have played this before. But we're going to learn a little bit about what the game is all about. And then at some point we might jump into Sandbox, maybe the episode after this. And we'll go ahead and start building some wild and crazy things. So if you guys have any suggestions for stuff you want to see built in this game, comment below. And if you want to see more of this on the channel, maybe hit that thumbs up button, let me know. And let's just jump right into this. Dear participant, you are about to embark on the toughest motoring expedition in the known universe. You are heading for the planet Tinka? A bandit resort paradise that became too dangerous for tourists and now it's been claimed by the trail makers. Let's see how far you can get and good luck and have fun. Now for those that are not familiar the expedition mode is like basically a almost like a weird or like rally mode. Like you have to get from point A to point B but you build along the way. So I'm uh, really excited to see what this actually looks like in the game opposed to the versions that I've seen before. Here we go. Oh boy, I'm excited. So, looks like we're dropping out of our little pod here. I've already customized my character. And boom. <laughs> Alright, so let's see. What are we doing here? Looks like we are on... Oh yeah, this is definitely different from the, uh, the alpha. And Oh, this game is gorgeous. I forgot how pretty this was. And oh boy, look at this. Alright, so I see a checkered flag in the distance. That must mean that is our, I guess, final point. But it looks like it's about to teach us about building. So if this is pretty much the same as all the alphas, I, I think I've got this. So, uh, the building's pretty uh, basic. Uh, it's real simple to get into. You'll actually drag and place blocks a little bit like Besiege. Uh, but it works based on the camera. So wherever your camera position is, it's kind of where you're going to build. And then, of course, we got the little rotating features here. Uh, so it looks like it's going to have us build a basic car. Uh, I believe we will unlock some more parts uh, the more we play. I know the uh, sandbox mode had parts, and I'm still kind of curious if that's still a thing. So, let's see. We should be good here. We need the little steering hinges on here. So, let's go one there and stick our wheel. And we're going to have one more over here. We should be good to go to start our expedition here. So, there we go. Oh, no. Misplaced the wheel. There, there we go. Cool. And are we good? Yeah. Oh yeah, we gotta go ahead and place an engine in this. That would probably be smart. So yeah, it looks like we're starting off with the small parts right now. So we'll unlock some more parts as we go. So let's go ahead and save this real quick. And we are ready to drive. So let's see how this little car handles. Probably not very good. Oh, it's definitely not fast. But let's see, what are we coming up on to here? Oh, this is so exciting actually being in the true expedition mode. And uh, thumbs up. If it ain't broke, you didn't drive it fast enough. Okay. Uh, I don't know what we're heading into here. All right, looks like we have a little bit of an off-road course here that we're supposed to get through. I could still see the little uh, checkered flag for the finish line, so... Uh, oh, we got this. Oh, here we go. Coming up to our first jump here. Uh, <laughs> wait, were we about to get timed or something? Uh-oh. Oh, yes. Look at the fire. Oh, this is so awesome. Trailmakers, early access. Uh, let's see. Oh, <laughs> Oh boy, Han. Correct it. There we go. Alright, so I know we can build and repair along the way. They normally have save points, but oh, I can already see spots I want to go drive to. Actually, I'm pretty sure we're not going to be able to get over there. Looks like a uh, water. Uh, this looks like maybe a save point up here, so let's go ahead and travel up this little hill here. And a power core. Okay, what is a power core? Uh, power core unlocked. Uh, I think this is ways to power more engines. I believe your engines run off of power cores. Uh, let's see. What do we have here? Okay, so here's a little power core. 
Uh, it's fuel engines. Oh, okay, that makes sense. Uh, do we need another engine or, or do we put the cores in? You know, I think for right now, I believe the power cores just make it to where you can put more engines on. I could be wrong. I have to figure out how to work these. Let's just go ahead and drop that. We should be good to go. Let's jump back in. Uh, I might have to look up a little bit more. That's the first time I've seen a power core. I've heard about them in the game, but it was something we never really experienced in the uh, the beta. All right, so we got a checkpoint here, and oh, we've got a little bit of a hill to climb here. So we've got two engines here. I don't wonder if we should actually. We're gonna keep all the weight in the front. There's something over here. I think it might be another power core. Can we get up to this? Uh, oh, this looks a little steep for a little bitty car here. Come on. Come on, buddy. You got this. No. <laughs> okay, uh, let's get a little bit more speed here. We're going to start here from the back. All right, here we go. See if we got enough speed this time. Up, 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 up. There we go. All right, so there's another power core up here. Let's go ahead and collect that. Uh, it says we can enter the builder to use the cores. Let me see. Maybe I'm missing something here. All right, from what I can tell, we've used two of three cores, and that's because we've used two engines. So technically, if we use another engine, there we go. We've used three of the cores. Okay, so that makes sense now. I got this. All right. Uh oh. Who boxes Han? What? What are those? Are those parts or something? Uh, I don't think we got anything from that. Let's go ahead and crash this other box and see if we can get something from it. Come on! Boom! Oh, that's disappointing. Alright, so, uh, we got three engines on here now. We've got two in the front, which should keep the most of the weight up towards the front. We could modify the vehicle even more, but let's go ahead and see if we can just, uh, run up this and see if we can get up this hill. This is, uh, well, this is a pretty daunting hill, huh? Come on! Come on, you got this! Oh, we barely made it. Barely made it. And there's another power core. Sweet! Uh, I'm tempted to break all these boxes because I feel like there's going to be something in one of these boxes that we want. So let's break these. Nope, still nothing yet. Dang. All right, there's a little screw up here. What, what is this? It's like a part or something? Uh, oh, it's a bolt. Oh, collectible. So there's 160 bolts that we have to find. All right, looks like we might be coming up to a part here. What is this? Oh, it's a two, uh, one by two block. Cool. So, I don't know if you have to unlock all this stuff for uh, uh, the sandbox mode, like you have to do the expedition beforehand. I need to check in on that. Uh, first off, let's go ahead and get a save in here. And there's some jumps that we can hit to collect some bolts. So, let's go ahead and do this. Woo! There we go. Oh, and it's teaching us that we can actually uh, control the vehicle while airborne by giving it throttle or hitting the brakes. Uh, it looks like there's a couple things to collect here. I kind of want to go across the bridge because the finish line's over there, but... I don't know, I'm having too much fun exploring. I kind of feel like we, we need to, like, modify the vehicle. I'm going to look at that bridge here in a second and see if it's something that we can uh, play with. And, oh, is that a half pipe? Oh, I believe that's a half pipe. Can we, uh, let's go play in this real quick. Oh, there's bolts up here. And, oh, there's more boxes. I don't know what's up with those boxes. Man, it just looks like there's so many areas to uh, explore. I'm actually a bit overwhelmed here. Uh... Oh, how are we supposed to do this? Is this... Are they all in one line? Oh, it looks like you might be able to go all the way over. I don't know. Let's go ahead and see if we can hit... I don't know if we even have enough power. Oh, we got... Oh, we got one of them. Oh, we unlocked a monkey. Wait, what? Oh, what is that? Let's go ahead and slow down here. What is this that we've unlocked? We got another engine. I know that. Maybe it's an accessory? Oh, we got a monkey flag. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, that is awesome. All right, so we now have a monkey flag on our vehicle. Uh, so unlocking or getting more bolts just does actually unlock stuff. I didn't know if it was just there for collectibles, say at the end of the game you got something, or... Uh, it's pretty cool, so I feel like we need to keep collecting those. Oh boy, so I'm still just wandering around the, uh, the start area. There's so many bolts. Uh, there's so much stuff to collect here. Still uh, kind of intrigued by the boxes. I've already smashed like a ton of them, and I haven't, I haven't gotten anything from them yet. So I don't know if they're just there for uh, extra destructibility. I have a feeling somebody or something is in one of those boxes. Uh, let's see, we have two bolts here. And it looks like we have another part up there, which I think up there that might be like a strut or something. Uh, let's go ahead. Let's get this bolt here. And, oh, this is a large grid block. Okay. All right, that's something I'm sure we'll use in the future. 
Ah, uh, let's see. There is another bolt. Where are you at? There you are. All right. I mean, we're really close to the uh, the checker. Oh, we got a thug. <laughs> we got a thug life. Uh, wait, is that what I thought it was? It was a thug life flag. Hold on. Uh, let's see. Can we put that on there too? Um. Oh, oh, let's stick it right there. Yep, that is uh, that is the deal with it. Glasses. Okay. Uh, we're gonna keep both those flags on. There we go. Uh, this is the first time I've seen anything that li that's living in Trailmakers, and uh, you're gonna leave me alone, buddy, right? You're not gonna come down here and cause trouble, are you? Wonder if it's gonna land somewhere, or if it's just casually going over. Not really sure. But anyways. I'm digging these flags. Oh, we're really still close to the, the checkered flag, so we'll wrap that up here in a sec. Actually, there's another one. Wait, there's two checkered flags. What does that mean? Oh, maybe we aren't close to the end. Maybe we're supposed to just explore here. Oh, there was a bolt under there. Okay. All right, there's something over on the island over here. I see some uh, animals, and there's a save point. So let's go ahead and make a modification. I want to show you guys how easy it is to modify your car. So we have this version of the car saved. So, what we're going to do here, let's go ahead and grab another one of these blocks here. Let's rotate it around. Uh, that way we got a pretty big... It's going to sound wrong. We have a big rear end. Uh, we could add another set of wheels. I just think that would look awesome. Let's go ahead, stick another one of these. This is probably going to make it heavy in a way we don't want it to be heavy in, but uh, still going to be cool. So, let's go here, here. Stick some wheels there. And we're going to move... Uh, let's go ahead and go here. You know, I could probably move the cockpit back. Is it attached in the middle? Yeah, it kind of is. It would separate the vehicle, but let's go ahead and put our other engine over here. And we'll build on this. Uh, let's go ahead and grab one of these front engines and we'll stick it. Can we stick it in the middle there? Cool. So I feel like we're going to have a little bit more power. Let's go ahead and save this. This isn't. This might not be our whole final design here, but uh, it's something. So let's go off this and check this out. Looks like the... Oh, look at this. Actually, down here looks like there's a bunch of pre-built vehicles. Wait a minute, some of these look like my vehicles from the beta. Huh, I didn't know those carried over, but look at how many power cores some of them take. 30 power cores, 20 something power cores, that's crazy. Alright, so uh, let's go ahead, let's hop into this. Does this handle very good? Probably could do some steering in the back, but uh, this is definitely faster. Alright, we're going to try to shoot across this island here and see if we can get to the save point. And there is a bolt right there, come on buddy. You can do this! You can do- No! No! I need to be taller! Oh, okay. Alright, well we know that is a- That's a big time no-no. We are not doing that. We'll need a bigger vehicle. I'm pretty sure you can come back to these points at any time. So, uh, let's go, uh, let's go explore somewhere else. Uh, I feel like we're getting close. Man, there's so many paths in this game. I almost want to go down every little path that I see, uh, We've been collecting bolts, and for the most part, they're easy to get. There's a couple that are a little tricky that I'm not sure about. What are we doing here? Uh... Oh, there's a bolt. Oh, look at that. I wonder where the end point of the expedition is. Maybe it's up on top of that mountain way back there. Very well could be, or there might be a taller mountain. Uh, is there anything over here I should know about before we try to go up to the, uh, the checkered flag, which I've been trying to get to for a while, but... I keep getting distracted. This looks pretty empty here. Uh, I feel pretty comfortable that we can uh, go ahead and head towards that. I don't see any bolts over here. Yeah, you know, it's weird. I haven't run into anything besides the exploding plants. Those little birds on the island. I was kind of curious about those. And then you had the big bird in the sky, which was probably just mama bird. Uh, but I don't know. I'm curious. Uh, a lot of people have been kind of questioning if they have enemies in the game. And I'm not 100% sure. I'm sure there's something in the game that can kill you beside yourself. Uh, oh, looks like we need to hop up this. Oh, can we hit this bolt? Can we hit this bolt? Come on. Come on. Yeah. Ah, and here's the checkered flag up here. Cool. And hey, there's another part. Looks like we got a, another block. It's a one by four. Sweet. So we got that unlocked. Oh, we're back. Is this the starting area again? Or were we in this area? No, this is a new area. I don't remember the loop-de-loop -loop that they have over here. So let's hit the loop-de-loop. -loop. Looks like they have a power core and another block. And all oh, that is a engine. A raw engine. Okay, what does that mean? Raw engines. Oh, they need two power cores. So obviously they're probably more powerful. Huh. I got an idea here. So let's go ahead. We're going to move. Or we're going to put this engine over here. This is our small engine. So we're going to grab that one. 
move this other one right over here and then we're gonna grab the new engine which where is it it is uh oh i need another power core what if i were to take off one of these so let me trash one of those okay so now we have enough power cores to put the big engine on so we'll stick that oh that looks so awesome up there in the front that might be a bit heavy i'm not sure but it looks cool so we're gonna try this out let's go ahead and save this design i love the building in this game uh so easy all right so let's see what are we oh yeah no i can fill the pickup now definitely we're faster and that looks like a challenge right there uh we're gonna need to hit that loop all right here we go time to hit the loop and time to get that bolt oh oh we got it we got it we made it oh we got <laughs> okay i want to say that we made it because we got the bolt uh it wasn't a pretty landing we did explode but it's good we got what we came for and there's another one of those birds back there okay so i think it is time uh, i think this is what we needed to get over this hill for the checkpoint but anyways uh, let's go ahead and get over this and let's see what happens when we hit a checkpoint here and see what challenges await on the other side of the hill here. Uh, oh yeah, we definitely had enough speed there. That was great. All right, so here we go. Checkpoint time. What are we gonna unlock next? And uh-oh, what's up with our car? Oh, area cleared. Okay, so we got four out of 11 blocks. What you, at any point, I believe you can turn around and go back. We got four out of five power cores. That kind of bugs me because I want the power core. And geez, there's a lot more bolts in that just that one section we're in. This is definitely a collector's dream here. So let's go and hop back down here. So obviously we can always drive back over the hill, which I might do some of that in my free time, but I want to continue to progress here as far as checkpoints, which I do think it's a good idea to go ahead and go back and grab stuff uh, because you're going to need upgrades in order to complete some of the challenges ahead. And, oh, this is a sweet looking jump. Look at that. Got that bolt. Oh, I'm about to blow up. Oh, oh, uh, we just unlocked a troll face. Uh, we have a troll fl face flag. Okay. So we're unlocking all sorts of funky things here, but I see another block. This actually looks like a, maybe a big set of blocks. Let's see. Oh, a four by eight. That's pretty impressive. Uh, hold on. I'm going to turn around real quick. There's a couple more bolts that I missed. All right. So we're still doing a little bit more exploring. I've been searching for some bolts. I'm just trying to see, uh, get a feel for where I'm actually heading here. We're not too far from the checkpoint. This is just like a little side path that's seemingly taking us, uh, it's taking us above everything else as far as the other paths below us, which I think that was one way to progress. So I think there's several ways through these levels, which there's another bolt right there. Oh, uh, can we get it? Yes. And oh, this is getting steeper and steeper. Boy, really hope there's a good reward up here. I have a feeling this is completely off the beaten path as to where we're supposed to go. Uh, let's go and hit this. We might be uh, due for another redesign of the car here in a second. Oh, get it, get it, yeah! Ah, and there's a power core up here too, so there's another one of those. Those definitely come in use. And what is this? Oh, here's a piston! Ah, we have the piston! Okay. Question is, uh, what does it want me to do with this piston? I have a feeling... And oh, there's stuff down there. Okay, I have a feeling this piston is related to this pole. And let me, uh... Let me check. I haven't actually played with the piston here in the game. Let me look at it real quick and see if there's something I can figure out as to what it wants me to do here. All right, so playing with the piston, I kind of figured it might be useful in certain situations. I'm not sure this situation we're in right here, it's going to be useful, but I could picture uh, maybe attaching some wheels to it and maybe that can lift our vehicle across like rivers and stuff. Now, as far as this actual situation here, uh, it looks like you can maybe try to grind this rail. I thought maybe we can get the piston up high enough and we can actually hook to the uh, to the railing there and maybe grind down and collect those bolts, but I don't think that's going to happen. And I really don't think it's safe to drive off this. So I think that was really just to collect the piston. So we're going to turn around and we're going to head back towards uh, where we began. Oh, that was a big shadow. Oh, the bird's closer. Okay. All right, so we're back in the main area here. We're going to do a little bit more... Uh, exploring here and oh boy oh boy oh boy oh no no okay we're good i can't believe we actually made that all right so yeah we're gonna do a bit more exploring and oh that's what i was looking for there's the suspension ah this makes the vehicle so much better uh is there something else around the corner seems like there's another part around the corner here too uh but yeah guys if you don't oh i'm missing a wheel i didn't notice that all right 
Well, let's go ahead and it is time for a little bit of rebuilding here. So we're going to be adding suspension to this vehicle. We're going to go ahead and I think we're going to ditch the six wheel design right now. Uh, it's kind of cool, but it's not really practical. So we're going to move all of our engines up and we're going to delete uh, these wheels here. This wheel, we're going to delete this back piece and we're going to delete here and here. This is going to make us a bit more on the stubby side, but... I feel like this is going to be good in the long run for handling. Plus, uh, it's less uh, area here. It's less weight, so we should be faster. Uh, let's see. That all looks good. So, the suspension piece. You're going to add them here. And, see, they're going to be poked out a little further on the back. But by the time we add the steering hinge, the wheelbase should be even. So, we'll add all of our... Uh, oh, that one didn't go on very good. Uh, let's look at it here. There we go. So, we've got all of our suspension on. This actually looks pretty cool with that motor in the front. If we had some cos more cosmetic pieces, that would be awesome. Uh, let's see what we're going to do. Let's go ahead and we're going to add... Oh, let me find the suspension. Uh, there it is, the steering hinge. So, see, when we add it to this, it makes our wheelbase, or at least it should be even. So, we've got those. Uh, let's go... You know, we could go four-wheel uh, steering, but I, I did notice in the beta, it's a little bit too sensitive for me. I like the front wheel steering, so we're just going to stick with that for now. Let's go there, there. Okay, it's looking good. I'm almost tempted to stick those back wheels up a bit higher. Let's go ahead and save this and see what this is like here. Uh, no, this feels pretty good. No, not bad at all. We might be a little on the wide side, but I think for the most part, I'm pretty happy with this. So, uh, let's continue our expedition here and see what other parts we can find. Oh, we've got a, a horn. That's another part. Okay, I've never had the horn before. Oh, and there's a bolt right here. Yeah, the only thing I've seen these boxes do, they block bolts half the time. Alright, so we have a horn. Obviously, we've got to stick that on because that's a cool piece. So, let's go up here. That bothers me. I'm definitely going to backtrack and see what I missed as far as other parts at the beginning area. Uh, where would horns be? Would that be actually under... Actually, here we go. So yeah, we've got a horn. Make yourself heard. Okay. Let's just go ahead and stick it right there. Actually, let's go ahead and aim it the other way. By the way, you can uh, paint if you do want to paint your vehicle, which we might do. I think you actually uh, highlight and paint most of it. Uh, what can we do with this horn? Can we just configure the... Okay, it's just... It's attached to space. Uh, it is kind of like Besiege, how you can set their map uh, different keys to different items. Uh, so say if you have guns or like a horn, you can actually change and bind the keys differently. Uh, let's see. Can we highlight this and paint it all at once? Uh, let's go with our Komodo Red right there. There we go. That's looking good. All right, let's do that. Let's go ahead and give this a save here. Uh, I might need to clean up my blueprints eventually, but there we go. And let's see, let's try to see what that horn's like. Wait, what? It's a police siren! <laughs> oh, that's too cool. Alright. Well, huh, where else, or what other trouble can we get into? There's so much to do here. It, it is really, really hard to decide what all I want to do. So, yeah, I'm actually really enjoying this. Uh, definitely, I think this would be something that you guys... I uh, would enjoy. I do believe we'll go do some uh, sandbox. Uh, not this episode, since we've already done quite a bit of expedition here today. But I do think sandbox will be a thing that we do here soon. Actually, it looks like we're supposed to go up this way. Uh, that way, and I want to see if maybe. Uh oh, this is gonna be bad. Oh, oh, we made it. We survived. Yay! All right, let's repair real quick. Yeah, I do think uh, this would be something where in sandbox, depending on how much parts are unlocked, we could build some really crazy things. So if you guys have any suggestions for creations you'd like to see created here in Trailmakers, let me know. Uh, we can do everything from flying creations, hover creations, about anything that you can think of, we can do it here in Trailmakers. So, hmm. Are we getting close? I can see the check... Yeah, the the checkpoint's right up there. I feel like we're getting close. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, let's repair. There we go. Uh, I got another little bump we can get over here. Uh, uh, make it, make it. Oh, nailed that landing. All right. Oh, and there's more explosive plants and bolts. I need to find a, I need to get to a save point real quick before I try to get those. And oh, the checkpoint's just right up here. Oh, I gotta hit that, hit that bolt. There we go. All right, let's, uh, let me hit the save point real quick. And oh, that's another power core right there. 
Uh, definitely want that. Let's go and hit this. Let's get this power core. And oh, there's a complete loop over there. There's a tunnel. Oh, and there's pieces at the end of it. Alright, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna collect these last couple pieces over in this area, and we'll be right by the checkpoint, so if we resume this, uh, we'll come back, go through the checkpoint, and get to the next area, but there is still so much to explore. Wait a minute, is that a secret piece? Is that where I think it is? Uh, that is behind this, isn't it? Is it? Hold on, let's uh, hop out here. Let me walk over. Oh, look at this conveniently placed piece. It's behind the tunnel or the pipe piece here. I don't think you'd get to that any other way. And that's an off-road grill. Oh, I definitely want that. All right, let's go ahead and pick up this piece real quick. And then there's another piece around the corner. I think it's behind a jump or something. Uh, let's hit this. There we go. Sweet. We got a grill. All right, we got a bolt up here. I feel like we, uh, we have enough power here to get that. So let's go full speed. Can we loop it? Oh, do we, do we get it? Okay, a little to the right here. Okay, we should maybe get it on the next loop here. Oh, 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 oh no! <laughs> oh, oh boy! Oh boy, we crashed. We're good. All right, let's uh, let's try that again. I think a, about right here. There we go. Got that bolt. All right, so wow, this one can take a beating here. Let's go ahead and flip that over. Uh, there is one last part around the corner we're gonna get. And it is, I believe, over a jump. Oh, that's a bolt. Yeah, there's a part. Oh, that's something big over there. I want to say maybe what's over there is a thruster. Uh, let's see. Let's go ahead. Oh, this is going to be a dangerous jump here, folks. Oh, no. I just want to land this. I just want to land it just perfectly. Oh, that was beautiful. Yes. And is this what I think it is? Yes, there's our jet engine. Uh, it's awesome. And there's a save point up here. Cool, that, that ramp there hops back down to the area we were just at with the pipe. Uh, but this looks like the last little bit here, which this looks like a, a very dangerous spot. Do I see any other pieces? Uh, oh, oh no, that's a... Uh... Okay, can we drive a car through this area? Oh, we can. Oh, oh, this was not smart. Oh, that was dumb. That was dumb, folks. Oh, I made a boo-boo there. Oh, <laughs> I think I need a little bit wider wheelbase in order to actually get across that. I don't wonder if I could just park across it and uh, maybe I could park on it and walk across. Uh, I don't see really any parts over there. There might be uh, there might be something over there, but uh, let's go ahead and try this one more time. I think we're just we're a little too skinny here. Now nope, look at that. Oh, we're going over. We're going down. No. 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 Oh, how's this? Oh, how are we doing this? Almost there, almost there. No, 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 no. Okay. Okay, can we, uh, can we repair? Okay, can we hop out? Oh, no, no. Oh, boy. Boy, we're doing it. Oh, no, 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 wheels. Okay. Okay. Okay, we're almost there, folks. Almost there, gonna make it to the other platform. Boom! Yay, we made it on the other side. And hey, there's a power core over here. That's what they made me do that for. There we go, nice. All right, and check that view out. There was our first checkpoint. It's actually, I guess there's a day and night cycle because it's getting dark. Uh, but yeah, I think we're probably gonna wrap this episode up here, folks. But anyways, folks, if you want to see some more trail makers on the channel, uh, be sure to let me know down in the comments below. If you want to see more expedition mode, or if we just want to jump over in the sandbox and start creating things, uh, also comment with what things you want to see created here in trail makers. Uh, I'm really excited for this game. Like I said, I do want to thank the developer for sending me a key over. If you want to try this game out, it will be out tomorrow. Uh, for the day this video is released, it should be out tomorrow. Uh, if you're watching this any other day, it's already out, so head over to Steam. Check it out. It's linked down in the description. Hope you guys have a great day, and we will see you guys next time in Trailmakers. Thank you.